Welcome or welcome back to another video. My name is Jatera from Brie and Nate. You are new here. Nice to meet you, babe. Today I'm going to be a chill video. I'm really going to be in the house with it because I thought I was going to wake up and run errands today, but it's raining outside and I don't got time for that. So I went ahead and downloaded the Safeway app and I put in like an Instacart type of team because who wants to go grocery shopping in the rain? And I got a stain on my shirt now because I sprayed my perfume too close. I'm wearing Prada Candy Kiss. No, I think Candy Kiss went out of... I don't think they made that in there. But it's the Prada Kiss line. And I mixed it with like Victor Roth Flower Balm. It smells so good. Okay, y'all. So I just got my groceries, right? Right? And I want to tell y'all. If you used to get your groceries from like Uber Eats or DoorDash... And stop it right now. Download whatever grocery store you shop at. So I did Safeway because I've been craving some hot Cheetos and some hot Cheeto puffs, and Harris Teeter never has them. <laughs> so yeah, download the grocery store that you want to shop from. Download their app and order directly through them because they be having the discounts. Like they show you the coupons while you're shopping. I know that's right. And then their stuff just be way cheaper than it is on Uber Eats. Because I was comparing the prices. I was going to do Uber Eats at first because at first I didn't have a Safeway account. But I was comparing the prices because I was shopping at the same time to see which one is cheaper. And then, you know, Uber Eats puts on extra fees that you don't have to pay when you go directly on the app. Here we go. So, yeah, now I'm going to put my... I can't even put my groceries away because I have a meeting at 1.30 and it's 129. So, I'll be back. Y'all, my hair look crazy. I'm tired. I'm sleepy. But I have to cook because I took this meat out. We're making chili. So, I got some of the ingredients over there. Meat is thawed out sitting in the sink. I got my veggies right here. We finna chop it up because I'm hungry. I'm sleepy, but I got to eat first. Okay. So y'all are about to watch me make some chili real quick. So I just finished my chili. It looks so good. I don't even know if I can show y'all. Y'all probably like, what the fuck is that white stuff? Y'all, I like to put cheese and sour cream and parsley on my chili. That's how my mom eat it and I eat just like my mother. So I'm about to dog this. Like, sit up. I wish I had some cornbread, but I can't make cornbread when I buy myself because I never eat it all and it just goes to waste. But I'm about to watch this movie on Netflix and chill out. Last night I watched Prisoners and now I'm about to watch... Stranger, I be watching the craziest stuff on Netflix. But yeah, y'all, I'm going to talk to you guys tomorrow. Hey, you guys. So it is the next day. Um, work is kind of slow at my work from home job right now. So I thought that this would be a great opportunity to put my tree up. So that's what I'm saying in my living room right now. I think I want to put it right here, like in between this window and my balcony, just because. This area is so bare, but we're going to see if I like it after I set it up. Okay, so I'm probably just going to time lapse this so you guys can see 
me struggles with this Christmas tree all by myself. Honestly, I ain't never put no Christmas tree all by myself before, ever in life. But I live by myself, so what is a girl to do? And I want to be festive. Last year, I was not festive at all. I was in a bad mood because it was my first Christmas and like my first holidays period without my grandma. So I'm trying to be in better spirits this year. So watch me decorate. <laughs> Y'all, I struggled so bad with this fucking tree to the point that I'm over here crying, laughing at myself. Like, I cannot keep my composure. So, the the tree part you see me putting in right now is correct, but it looks so tall from the bottom that I was so confused. So, I was second guessing myself. I'm like, ain't no way this, this tree part's supposed to go first. Because, why is it all this extra pole at the bottom? It looked like a stripper bitch can do her thizzle th on my tree bottom. Like, that's not, that's not right, but it is. But at the time, I didn't know that. So here I go, struggling real bad to get it out. Cause it's supposed to be in there, so it's in there. Miss girl, real, real, real tight and securely. But here I go, attempting to take it off. Just, just listen to me struggle real quick. Leg over, little shimmy. <laughs> I had to just, just thank the Lord real quick because I was struggling real bad. So here I go putting the wrong part in the bottom. Here I go. I done fucked it all out. I'm really thinking that this is what it's supposed to be. Now, here I go back with this long ass part realizing that these two pieces don't fit together. So I must have this shit all wrong. This is my third time attempting to put this bottom part of the tree on like... Oh my God, am I dumb, stupid, or slow? Because why is the bottom part this tall? I don't remember it being that tall, but okay. You look funny. Okay, okay. We get somewhere. We're getting somewhere, period. This tree big as shit. Thank God they give you these little extra things to like put into the tree to make it look fuller. Cause my tree looking a little skimp right now. It really look a little skimp, it, but it just need to fluffing out, I guess. Ah. Even though I struggled, y'all, it was so fun to put this tree up. And once I figured it all out, the tree was starting to come together, okay? This tree was my mama's tree. I'm gonna turn on the lights. I'm putting extra lights on her because half of the fucking tree don't even work. Put my little skirt on. I had to settle when it came to my ornaments because I like everything to match and all my mama had was rose gold and regular gold. I don't think those two go together, but here we are making it do what it do. And then I struggled real bad with this damn star because it wanted to lean to the side. Okay, you guys, so I think my star is crooked. And I really like a simplistic tree. So all I like to add is lights and ornaments. Um, Maybe in the future, I'll get into the ribbon and bows and shit like that. But right now, that ain't my cup of tea. So this is the final product. <laughs> um, My star is definitely leaning to the side. Hi, she was a little tipsy, but don't mind her. Now that I got my Christmas tree up, I kind of want to decorate even more. So I might run on to HomeGoods to see if they have any like decorative pillows that I could put on my couch. I really need some artwork for my wall. So maybe I'll go, but we'll see what they have to offer, okay? But get into the tree, period. I know that's right. My love. My skirt is a little too small, but she's cute. She, ooh, the star cord is irritating me. We're going to fix that. We're going to fix that, but I'll see y'all later, okay? Hey, y'all, so I just got home. I went to Home Goods, TJ Maxx, the Starbucks, and Sad Target, and then I went to Target. And if I could predict the future, I would have just went straight to Target because that's where I actually found my art piece. I can't wait to show y'all. It's so cute. I think it's going to, like, 
really make my living room feel like a living room because it's just been giving there for a really long time. So I'm going to need y'all advice because y'all see I got stuff on the wall already. If it end up looking too much, let me know in the comments down below. But y'all, first off, let's talk about why I didn't take y'all to the stores with me. Everybody and their mama is outside. I don't know what they're doing in terms of they they shopping for holiday for the holidays. I don't know what they looking for. I don't know what they buying. But they shopping for the goddamn holidays and they're throwing me left because all oh, too many people outside, first of all, and then so many motherfuckers don't know how to drive. And then everybody coming down the eyes with their big ass carts and you expect me to move out your way with my big ass cart. No, like you need to go around. Like, I don't know, it was just a lot. So I was like, listen. I'm just gonna do my shopping, y'all gonna be able to see what I got when I get in the house. Hungers then have shit. Actually, I'm lying. I'm lying. I'm gonna tell. Cause I did get something from them. I got this duvet cover. It's DKNY and it was only $30. And it's a king size. And it's real soft. Yeah, this is going on my comforter two nights. Okay? That was the only thing the homegirls had. Now, TJ Maxx, they need to close that store down. Or maybe TJ Maxx is not what it used to be. But anyways, went to Target. Got this nasty-ass drink. So this is a grande hot sugar cookie almond milk latte with two pumps of brown sugar syrup. Now, when you hear the words sugar cookie latte, don't you think it's already going to come sweet? And then me adding the two pumps of, of brown sugar was just me being extra. Girl, this shit is tart as fuck still. I should have said three pumps. I'm just not comprehending why a sugar cookie latte isn't sweet on its own. But that was my first and last time getting that. I'm going to stick to my hot, venti, vanilla bean. I mean, not vanilla bean. Vanilla chai tea latte. Yeah, with my extra stuff in there because that's nasty. So, boom. Went to Target. Now, this was $80, but I think it's so cute, so I think it's worth it. And Threshold be coming in clutch. Like, first off, I was immediately drawn to these pieces. It's a two-piece set, so really it's only $40 for one. See? But, yeah, I was drawn to this set because this is the exact color. Like, it's the color palette that I wanted to do in my living room anyways. So it just brought me back to like, yeah, that's what you've been wanting. So that's what you need to stick to. And I don't know. It's going to be on my wall for forever. I ain't taking it down. So I feel like it's going to be a good $80 spent. So enough of me rambling. Let's put this on the wall. Dang, they really, they really sealed this well, huh? Okay, so I ain't gonna cap to y'all. My paintings are off by like a mill of hair. And at this point, I don't give a fuck. So this is what they look like. I like it. I don't even think you can tell. Um, Like I said, comment down below if it looks like it's too much going on over there. And please mind all these boxes. That was the Christmas tree. And I know I just effed up my couch and I got a ton of stuff on it. Ring light. Disregard. But... Do you see the vision? Like, I think this is cute. I think I put it in the middle of the couch very well. And right now I'm holding the camera, so it's probably not level, but I think they look good. What y'all think? Okay, you guys, so I think I like the way this turned out for right now. I'm kind of satisfied with it. I'm sure I'll make changes in the future, but I like the way it looks. It looks way better than what it did when we first thought about, okay? And my Christmas tree is looking good. <laughs> I'm pressed. But yeah, y'all, if this ends up being the end of today's video, thank y'all so much for watching. Um, I will see you guys in the next one. So stay tuned. Make sure you turn on your push notifications and make sure you subscribe. And I'll see y'all later. Bye, mamas. Uh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Huh.